Alright guys, today I'm going to show you guys how to rip a DVD for free using a, a little known freeware application and a little and the freeware software that I'm using that I'm going to use today is called DVD Decryptor. Now what this does, it decrypts your DVD which um, I'm gonna say, which means it copies the whole CD um, the whole CD without use, without you picking the format. It's in a VOB file. Now, every time you rip a DVD, it leaves it in about four gigabytes. So if you guys don't have a large amount of memory or gigabytes in your computer, I recommend you don't do this. And but I will show you guys how to rip it in a different way in another video. But here you go. All right. So what you do? You put in a DVD, and I'm gonna put one in right now. So let me pause it. All right, guys. So I better put in the DVD. Now, I don't, I don't want you guys to be um, renting DVDs and copy them to your computer. If you have the DVD, um, fine. Then you're, it's there's a law that lets you copy, but you can't sell your own DVD that you copy to your computer and make different ones, I guess. Alright, so, so I, now I'm done telling you guys, no piracy should be ever um, in your mind when you're copying a DVD. So, let's get to it. Okay, now there's a movie that's really hard to find. It's called The Book of Love, and I barely got it. I got it for free off Amazon. Um, it was in my other account. I'll show you guys how to get it, but nothing about that. Alright, so here you go. Now yours will look a little bit different than mine, uh, including this. So what, if you want to look like mine, it's mine's the best. I have the best settings for this. So just go to Tools, Settings, and copy everything right here. As you can see, just remove, remove, minimize, switch A, uh, uncheck that auto, everything you could check right here. Or right, see, okay. Now file mode. Uh, yours should be um, all, but just pick main movie. Don't pick plus uh, plus IFO. Um, just pick main movie and all this. And I think that should be it. Oh, wait up. Uh, okay, and this too. Um, file splitting. Now what this does, it splits your files, but you don't want to do it. You just want to give it in one big file. So just press none and press OK. Okay, now you're ready to to decrypt. Now it's going to put into your to your computer in your local CD. Okay, let me delete that accident. Okay, so let me de delete that. It should be in your local CD disk C. Okay, so once you're done, um, go check the Windows settings. Press DVD. Okay. And it, when it should it should be done in about maybe depending on on what you, type of computer you got. Mine is a Vio Sony Vio with but does have a a really high capacity of RAM and memory and the the whatever you call it the hard drive the CD player is really fast I guess I don't know what you call it I don't know all about that stuff okay so but mine finishes about maybe ten minutes. And if you have a sole computer, I recommend you turn off every other type of application you got. Okay. But while this is going, I'm going to show you guys how to get DVD fat, DVD decryptor. DVD decryptor, you can just search it up on Google, Yahoo, everywhere you want. Um, now, now DVD decryptor is a freeware application. Now. Now here, here it should look like this. It says it's a Win32 bit, which means it's a 32 bit, but it doesn't matter. I have a, I have a 64 bit computer right here. But the only thing I do know about that, about this pro, about this, is when you're closing it for the first time, it shouldn't happen. But after the second time you use it, it should when you close it, it should you should get about three errors. But I, that's perfectly fine. Nothing bad's gonna happen. So download it. Uh, my internet's slow right now. I'm downloading, but okay. Here you go. Save file, save it. You should you guys should leave it in, in your desktop, 
install it and you guys should be getting a big ass DVD thing right there okay so I'm deleting it right now and I'm gonna stop it because I don't want I already have this movie so in my hard drive so I don't want to show you guys this okay so I'm stop it and do you really want to cancel no fuck it uh, I'm just gonna show you guys how we should look it should be right here this is how we should look um, book of love and when you're done it should be about four gigabytes and that's it DVD on console yes okay okay so here are the errors I told you but it's perfectly fine nothing bad should happen and that's it um, if you guys any if you guys have questions um, pro any problems if you're using this go ahead and comment I'll 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 respond to your comment or at least I'll try to all right mates